This is Victoria Hills. I'm going to tell you everything you need to know about this great neighborhood starting right now. Hey, it's Andrew Shackleton, Kitchener Waterloo real estate agent, Drew at home.com. This is Victoria Hills. I'm going to tell you everything you need to know about where it is, getting around the area, your recreation, shopping, and entertainment choices, the grocery stores, schools, and lastly, I'm going to finish up talking about the housing. So, Victoria Hills, where is it? Northwest Kitchener neighborhood, bounded by the railway tracks to the north, Highland Road to the south, Fisher Hallman to the west, and Belmont to the east. The central location of this neighborhood makes getting around really, really easy. You can get to the expressway in about five minutes if you take Fisher Hallman, or if you're in the east end, you get on to Belmont, get on to Sterling, then Homer Watson around the same time. You can easily hit the 401 in under a half hour from this neighborhood. For public transit in this area, there's a ton of bus routes. Four of them alone go straight to the LRT. So if you want LRT, you can get there probably five or 10 minutes on the bus, really, really quick. Let's talk about your recreation, entertainment, shopping choices. So just up the road from here, you've got Belmont Village. To the south, there's an entire strip of stores, shops, restaurants, groceries, from the corner of Highland and Belmont all the way out to Westmount. Other choices include Highland Hills Mall, that's just outside the border. The boardwalk's not even too far away from here. And lastly, you know, you want to do stuff downtown King Street or uptown Waterloo, you're really close to that as well. Oh, I should have talked as well about outside recreation. This is Oski Park right here. You've got Monarch Woods just up the road. There's the Phil Singer Natural Area and Sturm Creek running through the neighborhood. It's gorgeous stuff. And as well, you've also got, you know, you can send your kids to Queensmount for hockey, lacrosse, and ice skating. There's a baseball diamond right here. And then as well, there's KW Gymnastics on Victoria. So lots of stuff to do inside and outside. You know, great area for families. Let's talk about grocery stores. There's a ton of stores in this area. You've got Belmont Village for shopping. You've got a Sobeys on the corner of Highland and Belmont. There's uh, Food Basics in there as well. Just up the road, you've got uh, Highland Hills Mall, Real Canadian Superstore. You could go a bit further to the boardwalk. Lots and lots of choices for groceries in this area. Let's talk about the schools. So in this area for schools, the only one inside the boundary is right across the road. It's A.R. Kaufman Public. That's JK to seven and eight. And there's probably four or five other schools plus the high schools that actually feed this area, but they're not inside the boundaries of Victoria Hills. So they are Southridge, you've got Queensmount, you've got JF Carmichael, you've got McGregor, you've got Westmount. And the high schools, Forest Heights and KCI. For the Catholic schools, you've got Resurrection up on University and St. John's in behind me to the east. Lastly, I'm gonna finish up with the housing. Victoria Hills is a real mixed bag of housing styles, particularly to the east. There's a lot of uh, you know, multi-story residential and a lot of commercial property as well. If you want the suburban field, you really, really wanna be west of Westmount Road where we're looking right now. In this area, you're gonna find modest back splits, side splits, bungalows, and some townhouses and semis. Earliest stuff probably dates from the 1950s. The newest stuff will be into the 1980s. Anyways, this is a nice, affordable neighborhood. If you're looking to get into the housing market for the first time, there's a lot of choice here. That's all I got for you today. That's Victoria Hills. If you like this video, please hit the like button, subscribe to my channel, and have yourself an awesome day.